What's up everybody, welcome to another Let's Play here on YouTube.com slash KindaFunnyGames. I'm Greg, this is Bertel, and that's Tim. Tim, mm -hmm. we're playing your favorite game of it's all time. It's finally happening, Crash Bandicoot. Let's okay. get right into it. Why the fuck do you love Crash Bandicoot so much? Because it's freaking awesome. It is the natural progression of Mario from a 2D to a 3D world that didn't happen. That's what happened. They okay. made him a marsupial, they put him in this, this linear thing where it's just get to the end. It's the challenge. So it's always it, collecting all, all so this bullshit. So it's the start of the Endless Runner is what you're saying. No, because there is an end. But this is the start. This is the first step towards the Endless Runner. I guess. Hey, you, That's you, one what, way to look at it. Fruits? There's, there are certain levels in this game yeah. that are like the Endless Runner, but it's backwards. It's like gotcha. Indiana Jones style. Gotcha. You're running from the. You're world. running yeah. from the polar bear. People always love running boulder. towards things they can't see. Well, this is probably the game that made people hit that in the beginning. Okay, good. So yeah. So I'm starting off already. Yeah. I've been playing this for maybe 30 seconds, and it already doesn't feel right. <laughs> I'm gonna let you know that. Why? Because it didn't hold up in your head, or you're, you're in a bit I mean, this is, this is how I assumed it would be. Yeah. But is there any way that I could use the analog stick? That'd be nice. I doubt if Wouldn't you can't it? yet, I doubt, I doubt you oh. can. I, I mean, you're... Oh. Go ahead, try it. There we go. Let's see what happens. Now you got that now. Sure is working. Sure is doing its thing, isn't it? It's not working. Yeah, not at it's all. Not, Just like I told you. Not at all. Oh, wait, what? Now hit X. Now try it. That, that, was, that was my, my problem. Okay. I didn't do that. Try it. Try it. Try it. Try it. Try it. Nope. See? There you go. So just give up, please. Hold on. Why isn't it? And play yeah, the fucking... Way too soon to use the Thank but you, it, but it's... Colin. Give out 1997. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I can't... The PlayStation just like fixed that? No. Well, that's dumb. PlayStation can't okay. do a lot of things. Cool. That's definitely on the list. It does it on the PSP. The PSPs are awesome, that's why. It lets you use the nub. So the thing is, it's really imprecise. Yeah. Playing this game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why it wasn't a good game. It's because it really... you're moving, moving around in a, in a 3D space using this D-pad. Right. But the thing is, oh god. You almost fell right in the hole? You, almost, did. you, you got the crab man there? Now here's the thing, I got the... My, my homie Aku Aku. How can we forget? He's the, he's the mask. Sure. When you get him, he makes this noise that I'm pretty sure he goes, oh my god. But I'm okay. not really sure. Uh, what have I got? There you go. Oh my god. Yeah. It's not like, oh my god, I think you're right. Yeah. And I don't know how that was racist. Nick. So now I have now I have Aku Aku level two. Yeah. And then eventually you get a third one, then you go crazy, and it's like the equivalent of getting the star in Mario. And I like that a lot. So how old were you when Crash came out? Um, let's see. Crash came out, you said 96? Right, Colin? Yeah, that's what he said. 96? Yeah, that feels right. So I must have been like six. Okay. Yeah. And so this is just the coolest thing you'd ever seen. Yes. I didn't have this. I didn't have a place oh, to. Oh, here we go. Star power. It's kind of like that. It's exactly like that. Well, people at home don't know is that we can't hear the music right now. Yeah. So you are just ruining everything. I'm, what did I ruin? I was just... You added Mario. Given, where yeah, Mario well that way you said it was been. like Mario. Look, it's, it's nothing like Mario, hitting Mario. turtles and kicking them around. Yeah, totally not like Mario. Um, and as you play this, you can see a lot of the influences that would go on to become Uncharted. Because yes. of course Naughty Dog made this. Mm -hmm. Here we are in the jungle. Well, do you see the opening of this when he woke up? On the beach? On the beach with the waves, you see those pictures going around? Yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, That's yep. That's a thing. Do you oh, think God. Nathan Drake is... Is Jack. Crash? Or Crash? He's definitely not Jack. Yeah. I was heartbroken when Jack and Baxter happened, correct? Because it was so much better than this? No, you because it really, it really wasn't. It really wasn't. So I, I mean, do you, do you admit in your heart, at least to yourself, that Crash isn't a great game? No. Okay. Even though not. you said it was imprecise. Here's, no, here's my thing. It's not perfect. Yeah. Is it great? Few yeah, games are. It is. It really isn't, though. Like, it's not even just like, oh, it's not perfect than I thought it was. It's like, this is really not perfect. Yeah. But it's still good. It reminds me a lot of Donkey Kong Country. Okay. The first one on the Super Nintendo. Yeah. Great game. Not perfect. Yeah. You compare it to Mario, yeah, right. That's stupid. Same thing here. You compare this to Mario, you're a fucking idiot. But on its own, this is a great game. Okay. And it's fun. It has cool characters. It has, like, fun boss fights. It's pretty creative. And they have, they have a lot of nice little level gimmicks. They go a little overboard eventually. Crash 3, warped. Sure. Lots of gimmicks. Yeah. But they're fun, though. That's the thing. You'll never forget them. Never. Never. I do I want this back in my life? Yeah, I do. Do you really? Hell yes. Do you I want it to be like this, or do you want it to be I like... want this. I want... Oh, Jesus, get Yeah, him. definitely. There's a skunk for you. See, I'm having fun doing this. And this game gets really hard. Crash 1. Yeah. I never beat Crash 1. One day, it's one of my goals. I told you this a long time ago at IGN. Right? Yeah. I want to do a Let's Play series of us going through and actually doing it. Okay. 
one day maybe I'll, we'll stream it and see if I can do it. Because there's certain levels that are just bullshit hard. Yeah. And it's not like they're hard because they're actually hard. A lot of them are just challenging because of the controls and stuff. Okay. Because, you know, Crash Bandicoot. Because the perspective. Yeah. Because in the, yeah, the loose platforming. Mm. Like, this is not a good game. Oh God, what's happening? Yeah. Your mask is over there and you're over oh, yeah. there. That's what's um, happening. It's not, you're, you're stupid saying it's not a good game. Oh, okay. You're, like, you're actually stupid. Yeah? Um, but yeah, when I was a little kid, I was six, and I didn't have this, I didn't have a PlayStation. I, so yeah, uh, where does your affinity for this franchise point, even come well, from? Well, at that point, I had a Super Nintendo. Sure. I loved it dearly. And then every once in a while, I would go over like, to my uh, friend's house, and her older sister had a PlayStation. Nice. And she'd always be playing this, and Point Blank. Okay. Remember Point Blank? I do remember Point Blank. I enjoy yeah. Point Blank. Yeah, yeah. Um, and uh, I fell in love with this little bandicoot named Crash. Yeah. And um, I'll never forget him, you know? But the thing is, I feel like anyone around my age also loves these games. Okay. And I don't think it's all just because of nostalgia. A lot of it has to do with nostalgia. Right, but not all of them. Yeah. Just some. Like, they are, they are good games. Damn, come on, don't be blowing yourself up, Scott. Oh, God. Don't be stepping <laughs> on that stuff. Come on, Jack. Get out of there, Jack. Hey, Jack. Did, did, are you a Jack fan? Yeah, I love Jack. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm. Did you not? Were you stupid? I, yeah, it was one of those things where I was a little burned by it because I wanted more of this. See, I was happy to see them move away from us. Yeah. Take no, everything they learned here, put it into the precursor's legacy. Now we're talking. I don't know about that. So now, the thing about this one, Crash Bandicoot, yes, is that time. how do you, you are into these games, but you're not looking forward to ukulele. I am looking forward to ukulele. But it took you a while to come on board with that. You weren't well, um, immediately sold on ukulele. Well, that's because ukulele does my least favorite type of 3D platforming, which is... Collectathons? Collectathons. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But now you come around on that even. Well, I mean, I'm excited for it because it's been a long time since I've had a good one. Put the call on, Nick. Don't worry about it, Nick. Well, there we hey, go. there she is. See? She knows what's up. You gonna put in the nude code to see her? Yeah, because that's how 90s games worked. Pervert. Mm -hmm. You got your password? I don't know what's happening. It's reading the card directory. All right, let's give you a passcode. Everybody at home remember this passcode. <laughs> triangle. I'm hitting a lot of things right now. Are you hitting triangle? Because it seems like that's all you need. There you go. There we go. We're good. We're moving on. Looks like the passcode is one, everybody. Okay, Jungle Rollers. So this is when the game gets a, it, it turns a little bit more into a 2D platformer. Okay. So it's very, Do you like that oh, one? Oh, sorry, not this one. It's the next level, I think. Okay. Um, I like that it switches it up. It reminds me a lot of Mario Galaxy. It's physically mm, Mario Galaxy. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, damn, Mario Jack. Galaxy 2. Jack's dead, man. Jack, Jack, Jack is dead in a lot of different ways. I don't want to talk shit about Jack, because he is the homie, too. It's just, you know, I like Crash more. Crash had the best commercials. He was the PlayStation mascot. Mm -hmm. When this is when your your console needed a mascot. Yeah, and I think I missed that more than anything. Now nah, the mascot oh, Shuhei Yoshida though. He's yeah. a better mascot. I don't know. You don't know. I want to see Crash You don't know Shuhei if fight. Shu is better than I love Crash. Shu, but I love Crash. But here's my thing though. What you're mistaking is the fact that most people don't know this, Greg. I'm sorry. But um, it was actually Shuhei Yoshida in the Crash costume in this oh. commercials. Interesting, because mm -hmm. you can see the guy's face. It never really looked like Shu. Um, you are you know what I mean? incorrect. You know what I'm saying? Because it was just his mouth was the guy's face, and he'd put the megaphone up to his own face. That's not true. Yeah? Mm -mm. Pretty sure. Not true. Okay. Yep. I didn't know that was something else she'd do. She's done everything at PlayStation. She's done a lot of things. He only does everything. Look at this map. The Great Gate. Yeah, this is the level I'm talking about. It's just sad. It's just sad that as a kid, mm -hmm. you had your SNES. You had Super Mario World. Yeah. And you came over and you see this and you're like, oh man, this looks great too. Yeah. So it's like trash compared to Super Mario No, World. but again, that map, what does that map look like? It looks like Donkey Kong Country. Right, which is another trash game. No, oh my god, you are... Hey, you vitriol. I'm not, hey, I'm not everybody, let's connect, collect bananas and get shot oh, out of cans. What's the point of this game? We're collecting bananas All to right. get shot out of cans. Great. Thanks, Donkey Kong. You're a real fucking legacy. It's, they're not cans, they're barrels. God damn it. So... Oh, you crack under the pressure here. Can't even get a crash no, up there. It's hard. How quickly could six-year-old Tim beat this? Probably just like this. Because the controls are atrocious. The truth comes out, everybody. The truth came out a long time ago. I'm never going to stand behind this game and say that it is the best game of all time. Sure. I'm but it's your say, favorite game of all time. I, it's not my favorite game of all time. You if keep you, saying it's your favorite game of all no. time. No. God damn it, Nick. <laughs> what I am saying is that 
I want to beat this game. Okay. I'm having fun playing this game right now. And I want it on my PlayStation. Like the remastered version? I would love that. Give me a Crash remastered series. I don't need a new one. I just want Crash 1, 2, and 3 remastered. With slick visuals and yeah. tighter controls. Ah, oh, give me a, If they give me analog, I feel like that would help a lot. Yeah. See, this is the thing, when PlayStation came out and you go into the stores and play their little demo kiosks and this mm -hmm. is it, I was just like, what the hell is this? Really? Yeah, I did not like no Crash. No shit. Man, that's Crash, crazy. I thought the commercials were hilarious, don't get me wrong, but like, everything you're showing right here is pretty much why I was like, no thank you, sir. Wow. Struggling to get up there. Well, okay. Tiny ass little hit landing zones, getting fruit for no reason. You know I hate They're fruit. They're fruits. There's reason for everything. What's the reason to get the Wampa Fruits? Um, if you get 100, you get a life. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Damn, look at that thing. He's in here. It's screwing around. Mm. I'd be lying if I told you my hands weren't really sweaty right really? now. Really? Yeah. This is it because this is your favorite game of, favorite game of all time. It's my favorite game of all time. You want to see how... Crash can can you get Jack through oh, this God. level? Watch out, man. That scared me. My dad Marge used to Simpson. call this game Crash Bandicootie. <laughs> he didn't know if there wasn't a Y, and I thought that was funny. You, just let, you let him do that, though? Oh, God. You let oh. him look like an idiot in front of your friends? Yeah. Wow. Cold, man. Mm -hmm. It's a cold way to play your dad. Mm -hmm. I've never been a good person. No monkey business. The monkey was getting cocky. Mm -hmm. oh, Tim's getting cocky. There you go. There you go. Let's go. He got nothing for you. Nope. It has. It aged very well. It's time to just admit it. See, Kevin thinks this looks like fun. Yeah, it's true. Kevin is I deaf and stupid. Kill you, Mike. Ah! It's fine with me. Oh, bonus round. Yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah you better get those mm -hmm. hands nice and dry. Mm -hmm. How long do you think it'll take you to beat this game? <laughs> you said to stream it. That sounds like a crazy amount. You're not going to be able to stream this in one sitting. The game? Yeah. I don't think the game's that long. Tim, get well, yeah, but you're not good at it. Oh, yeah, no, 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 it probably, it, it should take me about probably five hours to beat. Okay. It'd probably take me about ten hours. Okay, okay. Step one up and it says TNT. You know what, I'll do it for you. Get out of there, don't, don't get cocky. I used to do that with Sonic games where I'd wait for the lava to get close to me and then run from the lava because I was such a badass. And my mom was like, no, Danger Greg, don't do it. <laughs> and I was like, get out of here, mom. <laughs> Oh god. So, I don't know if it's in this game. In the other Crash games, you get a bunch of different power-ups and you can like jump and do this like ground pound thing where you yeah. just splats that out. That sounds like a, that's something you put in the sequel. Oh god. And uh, so that's good. And then you get a rocket launcher that shoots the Wampa Fruits. Oof. That was fun. Does that um, deplete? And don't take that yawn as the fact that your favorite game of all time is boring as shit. Hmm? Is, does that deplete the number of Wampa Fruits you have? I don't remember. It's not a, is it a but commodity? It probably, Are we trading in Wampa Fruits no, here? But it, Show the weird. password for me, will you? That's your password, everybody. Okay, just remember that. Sacred symbols of PlayStation. Yes. The Great Gate, done. You're just, done. I mean, you're, you're cleaning I'm house here. through this game. Now, it does the same thing Donkey Kong Country does, where there's only save points at, uh, oh, okay, damn, I guess level wasn't done. But, uh... <laughs> Save points are very infrequent. Yeah. And you'll have to beat like four levels at a time. Oh, in dang. Order to be able to save. And some of them are really hard because they're surrounded by boss fights. And it's bullshit. Bad design. Good job, Naughty Dog. Yeah. Like that Learn studio will ever game. become anything. Hey, great again. Yeah. But you missed lots of boxes. I did. And I, I learned that the hard way. Because they drop them on you to show you you mm. screwed up. Now, the thing here you also need to remember is that Crash Team Racing is a superior kart racer. To? To your Mario Karts. Oof. Oof. Deal with that. It's just hard to believe that you drank the Kool-Aid of so many companies. Mm -hmm. Everything Crash, everything Nintendo. Mm -hmm. I just, I don't know, uh -oh. I don't know about you sometimes, man. So, we're probably gonna end the Let's Play on this one. Good. The old running at the camera. Nothing yeah. bad will happen here. This is what everybody Colin. enjoys. Colin, you love running the camera? Oh, yeah. Everybody loves this shit. Oh, here you yeah. go. Here's a little, a little present for Nick. 69. 69, 69. Wampa Fruits. Alright. Alright, we're doing this. Go. That's the Asian Jones. Yeah. Alright. Shia LaBeouf's franchise. So I got past 
The first one. Yeah. Can you do it again? Can I do it again? Oh god. You might remember this. This is obviously inspired when in Uncharted 2, Nathan Drake had to run from the car and shoot behind him as he yes. did it. Same exact That's thing. That's what it was inspired by. Oh god. <laughs> Nick, is there a tribal dance happening yeah. outside? Well, it, they're trying to do the Crash Bandicoot. Ah, inside. okay. <laughs> yes. Trash Bandicoot. Trash Bandicoot. Good job, Nick. That actually sums this game up quite well. No, no, no. No, no, no. You guys in the comments. Tell let Greg, us know. Say a bunch of obscenities at Greg. Miller. Well, also let me know what you think of Crash Bandicoot. Not to be confused with Brash Candipoot. Or Trash Bandicoot. Brash Candicoot being announced at E3 this year. As Naughty Dog brings back oh, the fray. Jeez Louise, Nick. How far could you get in this as a six-year-old? I got really far. Yeah? Yeah. But then there's people out there saying that they beat this game that I just simply don't believe. You don't, yeah. You yeah, don't Naomi that. Kyle, she's telling me, oh, I beat Crash Bandicoot. I'm like, no, you didn't. You're like, what you was not the final Crash scene? One. What's the so final frame? She would never know. There's no, no way. Idea. I don't believe anyone ever beat this game. No one. There's definitely not any Let's Plays on YouTube showing the ending really? of this game. Really? No, there is. Oh. I'm just saying. I thought that'd be pretty cool. I, I'm I willing... Oh, God. Fuck, 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 fuck. You gotta step it up, son! Oh, oh, damn it! Man. I'm willing to bet that no one I know has beat this game. Okay. Seems like a safe bet. Yeah. Portillo doesn't like that bet either. I beat two and I beat three. I know that for a fact. I know that to be true. I just don't understand how it can be your favorite game of all time if you mm -hmm. never beat it, you know? I mean... If you say it once, say it again. I'm a punk ass bitch. I, am, I would never say that about you. I'll say but, it. He's a punk ass bitch. Thanks, Nick. Thank you. you. Okay. Oh See, my that's god. where you oh keep god. stumbling oh god. Oh right god. there. Oh they get it's you, that, though. They get you. That's time. how they get you. That's how they got the hours Fucking of replay out of this shit. game. If they would have made it, you know, control well, then this game would have been a lot shorter and nobody would remember it. All right. But look at the fear on his face. No, the no crash looks good. Yeah. All right, all right, this all right. Is it. Again, we made it past now don't, one. Now don't, don't jump too early. I don't know if you're aware, that's what you're doing wrong. Do, I know you're what I'm doing You're jumping too early. I know what don't, I'm doing wrong. Right, it's right when here, I go through here, the, like, here. the hallway of here death. Here we go, so here we go, here, here we go. Run. I don't need to jump yeah. over there. That was what I was doing yeah. wrong. Yeah! Oh, I'm gonna move. Yeah! Okay. Oh my god, no, no, no! Yeah. That one's hard. Now I gotta hold down? Down an X. I gotta hold X or just mm -hmm. okay. No, X is jump. Do I have to steer him at all? Is he gonna just go? Yes, you definitely need to steer him. I'm not really steering him for the record, he's just going. Well, he's going here, but like, you need to steer him when you need to steer him, you know? Yeah, I guess. I, I like guess there. No. You just had to steer I him. I didn't steer him at all. I'm just holding down. <laughs> I've cleared my mind. I'm a blank slate. Crash is communicating with me in X and O's. Fuck! I was close though. Did I, did I give you, you a cold you chill? Got, you got far, farther than I There's one more after that. Did I, did I give you a cold chill? You did. Oh, I was shit. like, you motherfucker. Did you really not hold left or right? No, just hold on. If the secret is just holding down the whole yeah. time, I'm pissed. Again, it's it's kind of like that episode of MacGyver when he was asked to come judge uh, how these people picked locks on doors. Mm. And it was like it was like a Yankee swap, right? Where somebody would do it, the, the, a team would make the lock for their door and somebody else would make it and then you had to switch out and see who did it. And this uh, kit, everybody was overthinking oh, it. They were using like freezing coolants and stuff and weird lock picks. And eventually, on this one door, they couldn't figure out how to do it. It dawned on the kid that the door wasn't locked. It was never locked to begin with. So he just had to turn the handle. Yeah, I just held down and jumped and it worked. Right? I just blew everything up for you. Holy crap. This is how you can beat it now. Now you oh, know God. how to beat it. I mean, I've beaten this level a million times. No, I, I know you've never beaten this game. Yeah, see, here's where you, you, you have to start moving. Okay. Oh, God. Get past all these Blair Witch Project crosses. It's getting... It's coming so fast, Greg. If I had a nickel. There you go! You got to the warp See, zone. See, another thing they add into later games is he does the DX chop. Yeah, he does. Degeneration. Did you know that? No. Oh, really? No. Man. I, again, I, I had taste. Mm. No, that's just been thrust upon me by the community. I had taste, and I realized this game was garbage.
switch. No. And I said, no, thank you. Sir. No, no, no. You make good commercials, please only do that. And you know what Sony said? They said, okay. And then eventually he just retired him, sold them to somebody, it got rid of them. It was a bad decision, man. Now you'll never see him again, so it all worked out. He's coming back, E3 2015. Really? Happening. No, I'm just hoping. The I'm week playing. this goes up, Crash Bandicoot is He'll back. He'll be back by the time you see this Let's Play. That'd be awesome. Neil Druckmann comes out and he's like, you know, a lot of people are excited about Uncharted 4, but we're taking some We're time putting off. it on, on hold. Crash is back. I mean, it could just be a crossover game. I'd actually be kind of okay with that. Okay. It would just be Uncharted 4. They're like, it's a new subtitle. They should just do Naughty Dog Team Racing. Yeah, it's, be, all, it's all their franchises. Okay Get some clickers out there. Mm -hmm. Ellie. All right, ladies and gentlemen. What do you think of Crash Bandicoot? Is it, as Tim says, his favorite game of all time? Or is it garbage? Let us know in the comments. Then make sure you keep coming back to youtube.com slash kindoffunnygames for Let's Plays each and every day. Of course, go over to GameSpot if it's still E3 and check out our E3 coverage. And if it's not, then good luck in the future. Are there robots yet that are like fucking flying? 